tilapia fingerlings. Tilapia fingerlings. How much do they really cost? Hi everybody, welcome again to another episode of Fish Keeping Jamaica. Welcome to my channel. Okay, so today I continue in sharing what I've actually unearthed with regards to tilapia fish farming. Now, fingerlings are uh, tilapia, well, tilapia fingerlings are practically those. It's an in between stage between uh, fry and juvenile. Right, normally, as I shared with you in a video before, a fingerling is practically tilapia fish that measures to the length of the fingers. Right, so these are the, you know, this is a mixed stock, so you have both males and females. Um, I probably can guess some of the males and some of the females, uh, and this is primarily based on their build and their stomach, how their stomach look, right? Anyway, that's not the the point of today's share today's share is talking about primarily how much do they actually cost now if you should go by the rural agriculture authority in jamaica by spanish town to purchase fingerlings that's um i think they are a little bit smaller than these um for your You know, you start upon you're gonna start in the, the tilapia fish farming business. You probably can get a dozen, a little bit smaller than these, uh, for under a thousand dollars. That's Jamaican, right? However, if I'm selling this stock to anybody who wants it, um, this would cost primarily about probably nearly four thousand five hundred. And you might say, why? Why the three hundred percent difference? Or should I say, the four hundred percent? In, in difference in pricing okay so this is a mixed stock right meaning that they are able to produce you now the ones that you actually get at radar the one that you actually get at radar uh, will not be able to produce not be able to produce right uh, once purchased by one purchased by the, the, the normal tilapia fish farmer to actually keep in his or her pond uh, would be would have been monosexed, right? So therefore, they would have been um, practically transformed into males. You know, males breed. Uh, sorry, males grow a lot faster than females, and their meat is a lot more. You know, you have more meat on them than the females, right? Now you might say, so why is it that I'm selling uh, a mixed stock? Uh, bearing in mind that having big mixed stock there's a lot of dangers to it in which i've alluded to in a video before when i talk about my tilapia fish pond actually crashed okay the management of uh tilapia fish pond is not my priority right now my priority is to get my fish sold right the management is dependent on the fish farmer him or herself right so uh if i should let's say sell this i think it's a dozen and a half uh fingerlings to a farmer right that farmer would not have to if managed properly that farmer would not have to actually purchase any more tilapia fingerlings for the rest of his or her life if the stock is managed properly why because that farmer now would actually streamline having uh, a nursery tank having a brood stock having a gold stock and having a stock that is ready for harvest over time right i actually caught seven uh tilapia uh i would say it's fingerling uh three four years ago and that seven that i caught right actually multiplied in dozens of uh tilapia fingerlings i've actually sold some i've actually bred some i've actually um Ate some and I've still have over uh, 30 dozen that is merely uh, just released from the parent mouth right um, they are jumping 
I am now wondering uh what am I gonna do with so much um tilapia but uh there's not nothing beat the food right so there are great protein source and I don't think I'll be out of tilapia um protein source for now but the emphasis of this share is to, to share with you that tilapia fingerlings when purchased mixed stock is much expensive than tilapia monosex um fingerlings because of the mere fact that uh mixed stock are allowed to breed and when i say breed i mean they can breed from as young as this stage up until you actually harvest them for food it is hope that you have actually garnered much more information about um tilapia tilapia breeding uh fingerlings stocking you know how you actually manage your tilapia stock over the past couple of months well this is going nearly a year now right since i've been releasing uh videos on tilapia thank you very much for stopping by guys have a wonderful day i'm gonna try and see if i can release these fingerlings in my mix pot mix mix stock pond um batch of tilapia peace out guys catch you next time bye bye